New build home tour and the freestone development built by Nice Homes is what we're gonna be walking through today. But before we get into all that, please like, comment, subscribe, share, all the things that help grow this channel and keeps you in tune with all the new videos of listings and homes to check out, what it's like to live in Wichita and work with us as an agent and that kind of thing. But we're gonna go ahead and start outside because it's windy and so didn't want that noise interference to come through. So we'll see you outside there here in a sec. So now that we're out of the wind, we have a nice, large, formal foyer area for greeting everyone. Dining table goes there, living room over there, kitchen bar set up there. Um, so downstairs, your stairs going down or right to the left when you walk in the front door. Then you have your main kitchen set up in full wet bar um, with the half bath in the back there off the garage. Your primary bedroom and laundry room are back there. And then first floor, we have an additional bedroom and office space. We'll go ahead and check that out first. So right off the front of the house, you have this nice, tall, large windows, office space, with all the same wood flooring all the way throughout. And then you have your first hall bath to the right. So this is all brand newly built and designed by Nice Homes, custom build. Um, was a spec turned into more of a custom that my relocation clients decided to build and engage me as their agent on. So help advise them on a lot of construction methods and costs and resale value and things like that that go with building a home with Nice. And the services and the commission are already factored into it. Might as well engage us as a buyer's agent for everything for building this type of a quality home. So look at that kitchen, that thing is amazing. Double wall ovens, fridge will be installed a little bit later. Nice gas range over there. Plenty of room in between to pull drawers out. All soft closed drawers and poles. Walk-in pantry with your microwave located within there. Absolutely love the way they designed this fireplace. Designer tile, natural shiplap. A lot of nice natural light coming in here, white colors, but also mixing in some of the natural earth hues and tones in there as well. So full covered deck patio area, all fully landscaped, just got done, sprinklers are going. So this is your primary bedroom to start with, but then your laundry room area is right over here with additional cabinet space um, and countertop space for hanging. So it's very close to where you're gonna be doing most of your laundry. Check out that chandelier. The thing is awesome. Same thing with that back feature wall that's all real wood, done by a master trim carpenter. I used to do that kind of work and sometimes I kind of miss it. Walking right into your primary vanity, primary master bath with double vanity. Again, all this is custom made, brand new build. Nobody's lived in it, nobody used it so far. So nice big tile shower, plenty of room. Premium high-end wall finishes and tub. Same thing with having a built-in dresser. Toilet room to the left. Built-in pantry. Why did I say pantry? It's not a pantry. <laughs> built-in closet space with uh, nice tall built-ins and rods and everything to hang it with. So keep in mind, I'm a construction guy, not a design guy. So I know how these things are built well, 
but uh, it's the design factor that I leave to my cousin who actually designed this whole thing. So it's kind of cool when you know the right people and you're in the industry, in the trade. So that's your two upstairs bedrooms and then your primary bedroom. So you have three bedrooms, uh, two and a half bath up. So here's another shot of your pantry area with all the built-ins and the microwave in there so you can close it off. But then I like how they have this ground level um, intro area where the kids can come in, grab juice boxes, drinks there, or if you want it to be a beer fridge, you can use it as that too. But it's right off the back side of your patio area where you go straight out here. And so this is facing um, west. So this is where your sun would set so you can get some nice pretty sunsets out here. And then your hall bath, powder bath. Get the light on for that. Got some cool wallpaper going on on this one. Kind of some vintage sink and a little bit of vintage classic thing going on there. So like I mentioned, the garage space, garage is zero entry right away. Nice, big, tall garages, all finished out. Plenty deep for big trucks, plenty tall too. And then you got the 220 outlet for um, electrical cars to plug in as well. So there's your garage space. And that's the first floor. Keep in mind, this is kind of how virtual tours go with us. If you want to do a video call, if you're looking to relocate to the Wichita area, um, same thing if you're looking to build with us, this is how the process would go. So this thing was a spec. We walked through it when it was just framed out and we picked out all the finishes, you know, everything according to allowances and floor plan and whatnot that, that go with it. So uh, something like this, the Wichita area goes for anywhere from 800 to a million dollars. Just depends on the size, the floor plan, the features, everything you put into it. And you have your full living room area, which will have their whole TV set up and everything going on over there. And then couches eventually and plenty of room to run around and play for their four rambunctious kids they got. So this is one of the bedrooms for them. Bedroom spaces, much larger than upstairs down here. So you have three additional uh, bedrooms down here. We're gonna go to the utility room first. So this one is two units, um, two furnace systems in one unit. So one for upstairs, one for downstairs. Um, you have two hot water heaters that both run at the same time. A lot more things to go over in detail when we do the quality walkthrough here. But mana block for this. So just got done doing one quality walkthrough last week. We're getting ready to do one tomorrow and then we're closing Friday on this thing. But decent amount of storage area. Everything's well built, up to code, with all the most modern building methods, um, including the circuit panel with arc fault protectors and GFCI protectors. So always new code updates to pay attention to and be aware of. So there's your utility room and your one additional bedroom. Then you have this additional bedroom here and then there's one around the corner too. But this one, they decided to paint the uh, ceiling lavender on or one of their little girls, just to give it that little bit of touch and that feel to make it a little more personal, just like they wanted. So, um, same thing with the full uh, bath down here. I like their emerald green, robust color they picked for the top or for the uh, cabinets here. Same thing with their tile choices are pretty just solid high-end design. And then the last room, it's more of a blue room, which is, again, is made for the daughter and got these cool little chandeliers that are more of a brass color to go with them. But just cool little design features like that make it personal, make it more customized and all that. So that's the downstairs area. Lots of space, lots of square footage, very well built. Freestone Development is a higher end niche community and it's a high-end builder with Nice Homes. They're both the developer and the builder. And this one, let's go check out that kitchen one more time. Well-built, well-flowing kitchen. Got a lot of nice usable space, flows well. Lots of design functions that go with it. You can just imagine yourself hosting family get-togethers, holidays, you know, events, parties, all those really special important things that matter when it comes to houses. So that concludes our high-end new build with Nice Homes out here in the Freestone free development. 
Uh, if you'd like to check out any other videos in Wichita, what it's like to build a home with us, buy a home with us, or potentially sell your home, shoot me a message down below. Check out some of my other videos and go from there, and hopefully we'll talk to you soon. See ya.